oh my gosh how do i even start this video ah oh are we focused all right hi everybody and welcome back to another video and this is a super exciting video because i have got some life updates for you actually one life update in particular welcome to my new home in new york city we have moved to New York and we're going to be staying in this subletted apartment for the next month and so I thought it was only right that I show you around exactly what home looks like now. Before I do get into that though, I will do a quick life update for you guys because you may be wondering how I went from having surgery in Melbourne to now living in New York. Very fair question. To be honest, it all happened so quickly. The surgery was unexpected and so we actually ended up having to move the plans for this move over to New York a little bit later. But honestly, it all worked out perfectly because I was able to successfully have the surgery and we all know that I'd rather have the surgery <laughs> in Melbourne than here in New York. <laughs> Moving to New York has been something that has been on our cards for a really long time. I've always wanted to live overseas. I actually was born in England and moved to Australia with my family when I was 13 years old, but this feels like a more adult us in control kind of move. <laughs> And so it's always been something that I've wanted to do. I've got incredible friends who have done it before as well. And I've just thought it's really inspirational because there's just so much self growth and learning that comes out of it. And honestly, I can tell you, even in the last three days of living here, there has been a lot of resilience and learning and dealing with uncertainty that has been going on for me, which is actually really exciting. And so it has been something that had been on the cards for me and my husband for probably like the last four years so like one year into us being together we were like okay at some point we need to do a very cool move and that point is now and here we are in New York City it is so so exciting we are so lucky and so blessed to be able to do this we are still having a figure out of exactly what this is gonna look like and I guess that's what makes it really exciting too and I just can't wait to look back on this in years to come when we're kind of back in Melbourne, settled down with the children, being like, oh yeah, when mum and dad lived in New York. But yeah, so this is our new home for a little bit of time. It is such a classic New York apartment, which I am obsessed with. It honestly feels like we are in an episode of Friends, and the way that it's decorated is so sweet too. It just is so cozy and homely. And what's also been really nice is that I brought with me photos. This was actually Abby's idea, so thank you, Abby. I really appreciate it. I just really like nesting and feeling at home in places, and so given that we are traveling halfway across the world, we now have like a new home here, and everything is like a lot more uncertain. It is so important to me to feel like I've got like all my cozy nooks and corners and so I did bring some photo frames and stuff with me which I've put up all over the apartment and they feel really cute and it feels like it's our place which I love. I also love that there's lots of like New York references in this apartment and so it's just like a constant reminder that we are here in New York which is wild. We're actually so close to the Friends building as well. It's about a five minute walk away from our current place, which is very, very, very cool. We went over on our very first day and had a look at it and it just all started to sink in that this is actually home for us now. And we live here in Greenwich Village in New York. <laughs> There's been so many pinch me moments. Everything's just happened very quickly. <laughs> it has felt like really quick even though it's been something that we've spoken about for a really long time and so i just wanted to use this video to show you around the apartment and give you a bit of an update on what was happening in life and now all of the future videos are going to be very very new york heavy and also you can tell how excited i am about this move by the amount of times that i have said new york i keep referring to it as new york i mean it is new york but i just don't think i've said that this many times in my entire life before. So come with me on a little apartment tour. Let me show you around. It's really cozy, it's really cute. Without further ado, let's get into the apartment tour. Woo! I'll make a brand new start of it.
watch when you mm. Alrighty, welcome to the apartment tour. So this is our apartment here in Greenwich Village. This is the door that you enter from. And when you look around, you've got this huge, really comfy sofa. And then lots of really cool artwork. I just love the exposed brick. You might be able to see that we've done some personal touches into the apartment too. So I will give you a good look of them as well. You've got this really cute little table, which is where me and Mesh are having our little breakfasts and our little meals together. And then I just love that there has been the ability to personalize stuff. It's so important to me to be able to personalize. I feel like this stuff is what makes me feel really at home. And so got cute little photos and then this is actually the person that we're subletting from it's his little cuddly toy thing but it looks like Benji so I've also decorated that too <laughs> but look how pretty and then you look outside and it's very New York just got more of the exposed brick obviously because it's a building outside <laughs> um, I just love his artwork too it all just looks so cool. I love all the colors that he's got going on. Anyway, I'm gonna be have a look here. Hi, I am in my pajamas. <laughs> and then if we keep going, this is the bedroom. Before we do get to the bedroom though, again, another little personal touch. It's our little family photo with Benja. And this is the bedroom. Then if you keep coming around, there's this really cool bar cart, which I also love. I just think this place is so well decorated. It brings me so much joy. So lots of fun little decoration bits. I've actually moved things around a little bit just to make it more practical for us, because obviously it is a New York apartment and there is basically no storage. And this is also a sublet. So the person that lives here normally has got his stuff in here too. So I've basically made this just like a quick little pickup area. We've got our sunscreen, I've got my cap, and then you move on over into the kitchen. Actually before the kitchen, how perfect. New York or nowhere and actually this is like one of my favorite spots in New York and we're going here later today so the plan for today on a side note is that we're gonna go to Central Park literally sit over here and look out onto that view whilst eating Levan cookies so I'm in my element anyway we'll keep going through it's so funny I actually always have loved these arched kind of doorways and I want to get one in our longer permanent home but anyway, this is the kitchen. It's very nice and cozy, practical. We don't have a dishwasher, so that's a really good learning opportunity for me. And we have been washing the dishes and obviously drying them there as well. And then the bathroom. We've got, ta-da. Nothing like super special and nothing to complain about either. Although I must say, Look, I've loved all of the artwork in here, except this one, I'm not a fan. So we'll just ignore that one and pretend it's not there. But anyway, that is the house tour. I hope you love it. We are so, 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 so in love with it. It's just so cool. Like it feels very New York. It feels very friends. We're in Greenwich Village as well, which is like super close, like literally a five minute walk from where Friends was filmed. And so we're very much like in the part that <laughs> you would be in if you were living a life of friends. And so if you're in our bed, this is what you look out onto, which is again, really beautiful. This is the, you know, classic New York. You got your ladder. Let's actually have a little peek out. This is what you can see. And it was really nice because it was thunderstorming one of the days and so we were lying in bed and you could see the rain coming down in the windows and a very, very cool feature in this apartment is that it has got 
a projector screen. Now, oh, this is where I actually really suck at taking it back up though. I need mesh. Mesh has gone to the gym. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, and so we've got a projector screen, which is really great. And luckily, um, Varun and Anuja, who are just the loveliest, gave us their projector to borrow so we could enjoy it all. But yeah, this is the apartment tour. I hope you guys absolutely love it. We absolutely love it. It's also very cool because we get to be here for about a month. And after this month, we are moving to a different place which is very, very different, which we're excited for as well, because it feels like we're able to explore different parts of New York and like enjoy the different bits that there are too, and also explore like the scenery that's close by to the different parts. I really hope you enjoyed having a look around our apartment and I hope you love it as much as we do. It's honestly been such a cozy New York-y first home for us here and I'm just loving living here at the moment. We're very, very lucky to be able to do this and yeah, it's just beautiful. I'm so excited. We are now actually off to Central Park. We're both going to take our books. We're going to go and get some Levan cookies and sit down in my absolute favorite spot in New York and just like chill there, which I'm so excited for. So you will see that in an upcoming weekly vlog but for now thank you so so much for watching I really appreciate all your support and I hope you have the best day ever lots of love bye also I feel like I had to get like fully into the America life with some very American attire so there you go